Hi, today we're going to see how to fill a text with an image in GIMP. I will put the link of this image in the description box. So first we need to add an alpha channel to this layer. So right click on the layer, add an alpha channel. And now I'm going to create a new transparent layer. So click on this icon here, fill it with transparency and then press OK. And now I'm going to fill it with black here. So I'm just going to drag the foreground color. And now I'm going to make the foreground color white. So since the background is white, I'm just going to click on the arrow here, the arrows here to switch between the foreground and background. Select the text tool. The font I'm using is Montserrat Heavy. So here are the settings I'm using. So I'm just going to change the font size. So left click here to create a new text box. And now I'm going to type my text, sun. Press Control A to select all text. And now I'm going to change the font size. So double click here. Then I'm going to type 750, press enter. And now I'm going to align it in the middle here, in the center. So select the alignment tool. Left click on the text layer. Align it horizontally and then vertically. And now if you want to remove the squares here, just select another tool. And now select the text layer here, right click on it, and then alpha to selection to make a selection of what's inside the layer. So click on the eye icon here to hide it. Select the background color, and then just press the delete key on your keyboard. So here it is. And now go to select none to remove the selection. And now we don't need the text layer anymore, this one here with the white color. So press on the X icon here to delete it. And now if you want to move the image here, just select the image layer here. Make sure you're on the move tool. In the tool options, make sure move the active layer is checked. And then you can move it like this, so here. And now we're done, if you want. So for example, select the top layer, right click on it, and then new from visible. So here it is. And now if you want to crop this layer here to the shape of the text here, so select the background layer here, right click on it, alpha to selection. So I'm going to hide the image layer here. So as you can see, it made selection of what's inside the layer, except for the shape of the text because it's empty. Now let's hide the background layer, select the image layer, check the eye icon here and then select it. And now, for example, since I didn't resize the layer to the image size, if I press the delete key on my keyboard here to remove the excess image here, so it will remove everything except the text here, the selection. So I'm going to press the delete key. So here, and now I'm going to remove the selection, go to select, none. So now if I use the move tool, and here, as you can see, this is the layer here, the image layer. If I move it up, as you can see, it didn't crop everything because I didn't resize the layer to the image size. That's why you need to resize it. So I'm just going to press the Control Z to undo my actions. So here, Control Z. So like this. So I'll go to Select, None to remove selection. And I'm going to select the layer here, Layer to Image Size. So here, like this. And now right click on the background layer, alpha to selection as before, and then uncheck the eye icon here of the background. And now if I press the delete key, so sorry, control Z, select the image here, press the delete key, and now go to select, none. Now if I use the move tool, so here I can move it everywhere. So we only kept the shape of the text here from the image, so here it is. And now if you want, select the background layer, Place it under the image here, and then I'm just going to fill it with black here. So here it is. So as you can see, it filled everything. So I think that's it. That's how you can fill a text with an image in game. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day, and uh, till next time.